Hi there, I'm Liz from the WQED education team and I'm here today with the cat in the hat. You may recognize the cat from his storybooks, but did you also know that he has a show called The Cat in the Hat Knows a Lot About That, where he explores different science and engineering topics all through crazy adventures. One of the adventures that he goes on is all about sound, and in particular, pitch. Pitch is how high or low a note is. So like when we sing, let's sing a song together. We'll sing one of my favorites, ready? Row, row, row your boat gently down the stream. Did you hear how some of the notes were lower and some of them were higher? That's what the pitch is. It's just how high or low a note is. So I thought today it might be fun if we explored pitch by making a water xylophone. To make your water xylophone, all you need are six empty glass jars, all about the same size, some measuring cups to pour the water that you're gonna use to make your water xylophone into your jars, and then a wooden spoon to make your music. We're gonna fill each jar with a different amount of water, starting with just a quarter cup. I'm gonna pour that in there. And then each jar, we're gonna add a little bit more. We're gonna add a quarter cup more. So we have a quarter cup of water in our first jar, a half a cup of water in our second jar, three quarter cup of water in our third jar. We're halfway done. Put a full cup of water in our fourth jar. Now I'm gonna to switch to my bigger measuring cup. Okay, so you remember what I said we were adding? Just a quarter cup. So we have one and a quarter cups of water in our fifth jar. And last, we're gonna put a cup and a half of water in our sixth jar. Now take a look at those jars. Do you see how the, there's different amount of water in each one? So I bet each one is going to make a different sound. But here's what you need to do. You need to make a prediction. Prediction is just a guess of which one will be lower or higher. Which jar do you think will have the lower pitch? The one with less water or more water? How about the higher pitch? Make your prediction and then make your music. And all you could do is tap on your jars and see what they sound like. Did you hear the difference? Test out different objects. Hit it with a metal spoon, or maybe you can find a straw, something different that you can test the pitch of your jars with. If you wanna get even a little more creative, you can add some food coloring to your jars and make the water different colors. So you can have rainbow water as you play your music. Then, once you've tested all the different pitches, then you can make your very own song on your water xylophone. We can't wait to hear all about the music you're gonna make on your water xylophone. And we'll see you again next time.